we know how good and how high powered our offense can be. And when teams get us back and backed up and we're down by 10 points, we laugh about it because we know it's a joke and we control our own destiny. New Orleans offense is piling up points and loving every minute of its newfound firepower. Though schematically different, some are thinking Rams-esque in terms of potential and productivity. I think we can be just as good as those guys, so hopefully even better. We got 2,000 yard receiver, we got 1,500 yard back. I mean, we can get over 500 points in a year. We wanted to get more speed on offense. We wanted to get Deuce to be, to be our running back. He opens up more avenues for us. What we're trying to accomplish, we want more big plays. And the Saints have enjoyed a steady flow of those. How about over 40 plays and counting of 15 yards or more? Beautiful run. Plenty of room by McAllister. Redskins chasing. We look to try to convert on 60% plus in our big play opportunities, and we've been right around that figure. Chunks of yardage in this business equals points. Trading Ricky Williams last March, whose power running style required tons of carries, and letting Deuce McAllister loose has allowed the Saints more flexibility and big play opportunities. It's just like comparing apples to oranges here, but you know, Deuce McAllister is more of a Marshall Falk type of guy who can get out in the open field and make plays. I love Ricky, but Deuce is doing a tremendous job too. Was he ready for this job? Or was it just, you know, uh, you made If he deal? asked me that in April, I would have said no. If we had to play April 1st, then I would have played. I don't shy away from pressure. I don't shy away from having to go out and play the game because I think I've been blessed and I, I believe in my skill. Despite the many new faces, it's still Aaron Brooks's team. Given a multi-year contract just days before the season opener, Brooks, who's in his second full year as the starter, found his greatest reward in being selected team captain. I was like, whoa, I was, you know, do I qualify? Am I, do I got enough gears or credentials, you know, under my belt? It, it just means a lot, you know, f coming from them. And that's about as far as Jim Hazlitt's team will venture when it comes to singling out any one individual. We don't give out game balls. We don't do any of that because uh, we know it's a team thing and it's going to take a, uh, a team effort to win the Super Bowl. So why are you so allergic to hype, Jim? <laughs> What's uh, the matter? We're still a young football team, and I just think that uh, we still have a way to go. Things can go bad on your fast. I've been those last year, and uh, you're three games away from mutiny in this league at any time. So um, we don't want to be put our, put ourselves in those positions. This game with the 40.